Welcome to my quick customer satisfaction video of my all clad slow cooker pictured here. I bought this slow cooker about two years ago from a local kitchen store. Um, I used it a couple of times but then I had to put it in storage for a year because I was deployed to Iraq. Uh, I came back from Iraq in June and I used it a couple of times since then. It's November now and I think about the third time I plugged it in to use it I had this gigantic pot full of chili um, and I plugged it into the wall just like so and here's what it does it's completely useless you can push all these buttons nothing happens um, so I, I monkeyed with it for a little while and I called uh, all clad customer service um, they checked the serial number for me of course I'm just outside my two year warranty um, so the best they can do is recommend me to a repair shop. The nearest repair shop is in California. I'm in Hawaii, not their fault. Um, so the shipping is $50 round trip and they estimate about $75 to repair. I guess this is not an uncommon problem. Um, so $125 repair bill for a $200 crock pot. Um, and I'm comparing this to myself thinking my mother bought a Crock-Pot brand, brand slow cooker uh, back in the 70s, I think, for about $30, and she's had it ever since. Never had a problem, so I guess I was raised to think that when you buy a slow cooker, it's kind of going to last you the rest of your life. So I just want everybody out there to know, uh, this is what you can expect when you invest in the top-of-the-line, all-clad slow cooker at your local kitchen store.